Right, I think we'll go ahead and start. Um, good afternoon. My name's Wendy Fenton, and I'm the Humanitarian Practice Network Coordinator here at ODI. And I'd like to welcome everyone here, as well as those participating online. I see we've got a full house today, uh, just about, which is very good. And we also have about 80 people who are listening or who will be participating online. Um, we're here today uh, for today's event where we're going to be discussing the findings from a new study by the British Red Cross entitled Learning from the City, Humanitarian Action in Urban Areas. And I think you've all got a copy of the report on your chairs, so feel free to, to take that. Um, the study, uh, you know, drawing on its work in Port-au-Prince, Kathmandu, Kampala, Djiboutiville, and Ulaanbaatar, Learning from the City looks at the operational implications of urban risk and vulnerability and highlights five priorities for the British Red Cross and the wider humanitarian community for improving responses in urban areas. And this is what we're going to be discussing today. But before we begin the session, before I introduce our speakers and, and we begin the session, I just have a few housekeeping announcements. If the fire alarm sounds, please exit out of these doors and turn right, go past reception and out the front door. Um, please turn off your mobile phones if you haven't done so already. And just to remind you that this is a public event, so it is being streamed online and everything is a matter of public record. And so we will be posting a video of the event online uh, probably early to mid next week. So. Um, if you'd also like to tweet about the event, do live tweeting. The hashtag is urban learning. And that's enough housekeeping, so let's, let's start. Um, I wanted to say that we're really pleased to have with us three distinguished speakers today. And the, we've got Samuel Carpenter on my immediate right, who is a co-author of the study. And we have Amelia Chiazzi over here, who is uh, the primary author of the study, too. And Colin Oh, right, sorry. I, I don't think we've met, so we have all the authors of the study here today. Um, we also have Elena Lucci, who's on my left, and I'll be introducing her in more detail later, and Francois Grunewald, who I'm sure most of you know, who's on my far right. But we're going to start with uh, Sam Carpenter, and he's going to give us a briefing on the paper and highlight the key findings of the report. Sam, as I said, is a co-author, but he's working at the British Red Cross as a humanitarian policy advisor, where he leads the learning project on humanitarian action in urban areas. Previously, he worked with the Humanitarian Futures pro uh, Program at King's College, and he's also worked with the Secure Livelihoods Research Consortium here at ODI. So without further ado, I'm going to hand over to Sam. Thanks, Wendy. 